What is going on guys? Today we are looking at the next objective and it is the Air Divisier objective for my man Junior. A left back 89 Brazilian. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful and I forgot that we do get two objectives so we have got Parejo. Check that video out at the end of this video and again vice versa if you're watching Parejo's video and you've come here make sure you hit that like and subscription button if you haven't. But today we're going to show you how do you do Mar is it Maro? Maro? I'm ignore me junior how do you do his objectives quickly and normally what we do get is we get the major league is in an objective online in friendlies and normally you can do these in squad battles or rivals which looks like you can do so far we have got plenty of squad battles news coming very soon so stay tuned for all of that but i can imagine a lot of people will be doing these score in three separate squad battle matches on a minimum professional or in rivals, if you're grinding for elite, you can do both. Um, and you've got to score using a player with four-star skill moves. To be honest, you can do that in rivals pretty easily if you are grinding up the ranks to get your matches anyway. I wouldn't necessarily go out of my way to try and do that in squad battles, but we'll see. Score two goals using Air Divisie players in two separate squad battle matches on minimum professional. Now, this would depend on how good your Air Divisie players are and also what rank you're in. If you are Division 1, the likely chance is you're not using Hilaire up front because I'm pretty sure he's one of the only. If you've got a few of the team of the seasons, there's a chance, most definitely. Um, assist, oh God, assist using defenders in three separate squad battle matches. And this is this is where it is. So you've got to have at least five Eredivisie players in your starting lineup. Assist using defenders in three separate, um, that's okay, a standard. And score using, eight, uh, score using Brazilian players in eight squad battle wins. So... If you are in rivals, it will be a rival win. So if you have scored and you're not winning, it technically won't count. So that's the difference. So if we go in quickly and build a, well, a Brazilian Air Divisie squad, and then we'll show you what sort of uh, level that we're looking at here. Again, with squad battles, with rivals, you can use your loans if you really want to. But if we do go and just type in I'm not going to cut that, but I guarantee someone's going to comment. But objectives is going to be on here. And I'm interested. Do we have any Brazilian Eredivisie players left? So we did actually get this beautiful team of the season. We've got Timber already. We have a Martinez if we want, but I'm pretty sure he's out. He is out of contract, so I don't understand why we haven't got rid of him. But I think the big thing that we're going to struggle with here is obviously the Brazilians. Um, we have got a striker here because predominantly I'm going to do this on squad battles anyway. Um, I don't mind. We have technically got a centre-back if we wanted. If we're going to bring a Brazilian into it, I know the Brazilian that I've got. Um, very, very fortunate to have a beautiful Garincha. So if we're going to set up the team like here. We'll probably put him in a 4-3-3 to get him up top with Hilaire. Then we know that we can get both of the goals absolutely easy. But just give you an example of a team. Obviously, we have used a few of the cards in objectives in SBCs and stuff. Um, so there is a few missing. But I can imagine we will go and grab a lot of the team of the seasons as we grind through the packs that we're saved up. And I can imagine you're all the same to be honest we're going to be absolutely spamming them packs until we get a lot of these team of the season so if you're not already make sure you check out the stories that is where i'm going to be posting all of my team of the season pack pools just to give you another sort of content rather than making an extra video on top of everything else i thought it'd be an easy watch you can see all the packs that get team of the seasons and this is it this is all you've got to do what i would suggest in uh, kind of like the starting games get your brazilian goal because that is the eight separate and then get the defender up front to do them and then obviously we can go and do um, whatever's left basically so we'll just take a double look before we get into the end of it um, we'll have a look at junior's card as well so scoring separate standard i'm pretty sure grinch is a four star uh, skiller then we've got score two goals for verde vizier perfect haller just gets a brace and you've only got to do that in two and then you can technically just get brazilians up front assist using defenders and three separate so again three matches and you're out with that three matches you just put timber up front slap him in and there you go jobs an absolute good one, and then score with a brazilian so a pretty standard objective to be honest and a very good card back great pace you can whack um, i'm guessing a sentinel on him or something because then that raises the defense and physical very very nicely uh four star three star left footed with a high high five seven outside of the foot and flare as the traits very nice indeed 
Great pace on him, fantastic. Little bit of shooting, nothing too crazy. Great short pass, curve and crossing. Even vision up there. Agility balance is beautiful. Composure's on that little bit of a lower end at this point. But again, I feel like that is manageable. And then with the defended and physical, I know I have no problems with that going up. So a fantastic card straight off the bat. You get a 390 and a 389 with just a bit of a grind. Let me know if you're going to be completing him. And if you want to see more content, hit that subscription button. And we're going to be getting on to the reviews very soon. Catch you all for the next one. Peace.